Oh, hey boo, it's your gay guy, Jam. Welcome back to my channel. Yay! Wow. I'm starting a new segment in my YouTube videos where it's called Gay and Tired Segment. Well, I'm the gay one and I'm also tired, by the way, like, because I work a lot. So I'm just doing this on the side and I'm hence, I'm tired and girl, I need a sip of my coffee. <laughs> So, let's do this. Ugh. Ugh. Coffee. Oh my gosh, it's, it's hot though. Whew. For this gay and tired segment, we're gonna do makeup reviews, makeup wear test, makeup shits, anything that's related with makeup outside where you can actually see how the makeup looks outside, not in a controlled setting like a studio or anything like that. Because if you're gonna look beautiful, you wanna go outside and be complimented by somebody, you know what I mean? If you know what I mean. Wink wink. By the way guys, are you living for my new haircut? Like girl, she's fierce or whatever. For today's gay and tired segment, we're doing a makeup review of the new Hard Candy Glitterasi Glitter Reveal Lip Color, available at Walmart. This riddles for $6. I have three shades with me. There is a total of six shades. I just got three shades for me to try it out. So let's do this. So for the Hard Candy Glitterasi Glitter Reveal Lip Color, it says here, just apply, let dry, press and play. For the first color, we're doing this called Dazzle. Um, this is this brown nude taupe color. It's really beautiful. I mean, first of all, let's talk about the packaging. For $6, you cannot go wrong with this. Look at this mermaid cap. It's so beautiful. One swipe. Whew. Can you all see that? That's beautiful. I also got this little cute adorable rainbow poop lip balm. So let's use this baby up before we, we start our swatching in our lips. So let's use this puppy up and see how this one works on my lips. This is Dazzle. This is how Dazzle looks on my lips. So let's put the timer on for 90 seconds and let's see how she dries 90 seconds is up guys so let's see how this one performs they say first of all it feels dry some sort it does not dry fully matte it's still a little moist how that's how I can say it um, let's see if I roll my lips over and see if there's some sparkles that comes out three two one Hmm. Can you all see the sparkles? I mean, like. There's barely anything there. I mean, there's some sparkle, but not too much. And I don't like how it's like streaky on the middle. I don't know if you can. I'll zoom in so that you can see where it is. And it's drying on my lip wrinkles if you can see that i'll zoom in more as you can see right there and it's cracking already and that's how she's gonna look when you step outside your studio or your makeup room i'm i'm not a big fan of this one for the next shade we have this beautiful charm color um this is this really pretty red pinkish color so let's swatch this baby up one swipe actually that was two swipes but girl look how pretty that is it's just this stunning like almost push of a color so let's see how this one performs on my lips So this is charmed on my lips. It has not yet fully dry. Application wise of this one was a little better than the other one. So that I think that's a consistency issue. Um, this one, you do have to go in back and forth to perfect your lips. 
So let's wait 90 seconds and let it dry. 90 seconds is up. Let's see if it dries well. After 90 seconds, it does dry up to a semi matte, not like a fully matte. That's how I can see it. Um, there is sparkles coming out already, but not too dramatic, not too crazy. It's just hint of sparkles here and there. Um, it feels, it feels better than the dazzle one, to be honest with you guys. So let's see, boost if it sparkles. Three, two, one. Girl, it does sparkle. Hmm, I'm gonna roll over. Ooh, ooh. Ah, so much better than the Dazzle one. This charm one, it's like Snow White. Move, please. A new Snow White princess is coming in town. Hmm. So this is charm swatch on my lips. Um, let's see if it color transfers. Not too crazy, really not too crazy. Like, a little bit, but not too... There. The sparkles, though, do transfer, but the lip color stays on the lips, which is a good thing. All right, Boost, for the third lip shade, this is called Glamour. This is, it's this really beautiful purple color, deep purple color. So let's swatch this baby up. Oh my gosh, Boos. Oh my gosh. The sun is like disappearing. Like I only have a few more minutes. So let's see how this one looks. Swatch. Ooh. Ooh. Look at that color. Stunning. So let's see how this puppy works on my lips. My lips are looking raw right now. So <laughs> bear with me. My gosh, Maleficent, move over. There's a new bitch in town. Let's give it 90 seconds to dry and see how this one performs. 90 seconds is up. Let's see if this one reveals more glitter than the second one. This one looks much better. It does dry out to this matte finish. I'm zoom in so that you can see better. Um, let's roll our lips and see if there's more glitter to come. Girl, she glittery. Mm -mm. Oh, it did, like on the inner side of my lips. If you, I don't know if you can see that, guys. But right there. Mm. See, the pigment has disappeared. But outside, I think it's just my application that was the wrong one. But girl, overall, this one glitters the most. Like. I'm digging that purple glitter like girl Maleficent move bitch mm. so what do you think boost oh my gosh boost the Sun is already set um, it's a good thing I have one light right there um, this is the first episode that I'm doing my gay and tired segment where I do my makeup reviews outside so that you can see the full effect of the makeups that we are testing as of the moment Final thoughts of the Hard Candy Glitterazzi Glitter Reveal Color. I do like them. I mean, for $6, it's worth it. Um, depending on who you are or how your budget is. If, for example, if you ask me and you're on a tight budget, you want a lipstick that is actually looks good, dries semi-matte, and stays on your lips with a little bit of sparkle to them, I would recommend this because this is $6 available at Walmart. If you want to spend a little bit more, I wouldn't recommend this one because it tends to be a little streaky and the pigment is not consistent all throughout. As you can tell, like I didn't plan this. The Dazzle one, it's not dazzling at all. Um, the Charm one was okay and the best one was the Glamour one. So, I mean, I think it's just a consistency issues with all of them. All right, boost. that's about it for my Glitterazzi. 
All right, boys, that's about it for my hard candy glitter rats review. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, boys. Get naked. Bye.